The Japanese create invisible mice? Well, mouse traps are practically gonna be useless. Yo guys, what's up? Dave Waffle here and welcome to IO. So if you could have any superpower, what would it be? Let me know down there. So that's right, guys. Japan has done it again. Really given us amazing science, technology stuff. And no, I'm not obviously talking about, you know, singing toilets. This time, it's mice that are transparent. Okay, so what does a see-through mouse look like? Well, you know what? Let's take a look at it. Be prepared, because it is kind of disgusting. Ugh. Oh, man, what the heck is that thing? It looks like a giant blob of Vaseline. If you guys agree with me that this thing is pretty creepy looking, hit that like button, please. So scientists at the Riken Quantitative Biology Center in Osaka University have made mice practically see-through by changing the pigment of, well, they're tissues. I'm talking tissues, like this sort of stuff. Now originally they actually had problems trying to change the mice's color of their hemoglobin. This pretty much puts the red in the red blood cells, but they actually discovered that the same process that they use to make a brain transparent for imaging works the same way for your hemoglobin. And this has been a challenge that they've been working on for years, man. Now okay, you're probably wondering how long does it take to do this sort of thing? Is it like the invisible man, you just inject yourself with a needle and then all of a sudden you're like, You've completely disappeared. Well, this process actually takes about two weeks to complete. Man, that's totally ronka donka dink Who would do this to mice? They actually do this process so they can actually see what it looks like on the inside of a mouse without cutting it up. Now, no, this process does not actually work on living beings. So that makes the mice actually dead while they do this. And with this new technology, they feel like they will have a better understanding of how diseases work in human beings. So thanks for watching, guys. My name is Dave Waffle. As I always say, keep it real, keep it classic, keep it on the flip side, out there in the invisible world. Hmm.